Hello everyone, welcome back again. Today we are going to create a simple pen for exercise number one. Okay, first in here we can create line objects. You can click start from this point. We can set into 3000. And then you can use scroll mouse to zoom in and zoom out. And you can press uh, scroll mouse to use pen. You can move to the top here, we can set into 6000. You can move to the left, we can set into 3000. And then you can click at this point. Okay, you can press uh, middle mouse twice to use a zoom extend. And then I will press F7 to hide code. The next in here we can copy these objects. Okay, you can uh, move up from this point, you can click and move to the bottom here, we can set into 2500. Okay, we can create again uh, 4000. Okay, now you can copy this object. You can tap CO, press enter, select uh, this line objects. Click from this point and move into here, middle point. The next use uh, trim command. You can tap TR, press enter to S, and we can cut uh, these lines also at this point. Okay, now we can join uh, these uh, objects. You can tap G to use a uh, join command, press enter. Select uh, these objects and press enter again to join. You also can join uh, these two lines objects. The next, I will use offset. You can tap offset, press enter. You can set for offset distance into 150. The next, I will click at uh, these uh, objects and click inside. We offset again with offset distance 75. Click uh, these uh, objects to the bottom here and uh, to the top. Same as uh, this uh, line object. Okay, you can select uh, this uh, middle lines and you can press delete button to erase. And now in here we can use trim command again. You can tap the R, press enter to S, and you can cut in here. We cut again at this point. Okay, the next in the bottom here, and the last at this point. Okay. Now in here we can insert for furniture from block. You can get uh, this block from uh, download link in uh, description below this video. First in here we can insert door. You can click here, and then I will click at this point to insert. The next I will use mirror command to mirror uh, these objects from this point to the top, and I will use yes to erase uh, short objects. In here we can use a copy command to copy this object start from this point. And then we can move into here. You also can move into this point. If you don't see snap in uh, this object, you can active first. You can tap DS to open drafting settings. And then you can uh, click object snap tab. We can active all these uh, snap options. You can click OK. In here, we can use a trim command to cut uh, this line and also in here. The next, we can use a rotate command to rotate uh, these objects. I will rotate into 90 degree. Uh, sorry, we can undo. We can use a mirror first, these objects. And now I will uh, delete. Use a rotate command to rotate uh, this object 90 degree, and then you can move command to move uh, this object from uh, this point. We can move into this point. The next, you can use a trim command to cut uh, this line object. Okay, now in here we can insert another block. Okay, we can insert like for toilet. I will click at this point. Use a rotate command again to rotate uh, this object to this point and you can move tools use uh, move command to move uh, this object from this point into here okay the next we can insert for sofa seat click at this point in here you can uh, double click the block and then you can click in here sofa seat and click ok so we can edit uh, this block i will uh, edit in here you can select and press delete button Okay, we can delete uh, this object and then you can click uh, close uh, block editor now you can click save the change to sofa seat in here you can use move tools to move uh, these objects from a build point into this point 
okay we can insert again for another like in here we can insert for kitchen so i will click at this point kitchens you can copy these objects from this point into here the next we can set for a refrigerator in here okay and then for watch machines in at this point okay the next for bed we can click uh, these uh, blocks and we can move into here i will use a rotate command to rotate uh, these objects 90 degree and then you can move to the top here the next we can insert for window okay, in here you can search for window single window and i will uh, click at this point the next we can use a rotate command to rotate uh, this window we can move from this point into this point the next you can copy these objects into here and then we can rotate again 90 degree now you can use the move command to move all these objects start from middle points into this point okay in here we can insert hatch you can tap hatch to open create a hatch into this floor plans we can set into nc31 for patterns for color i will set into orange and we can use a pick points we can click in here also at this point and then in here the next we can change scale i will change in here into 20 so it will be automatically updates and you can click close hatch creation so it will be quad hatch in a display pen now we can insert a dimension for the last steps you can tap d to open a dimension style manager in here i will use annotative and you can click set current click a modify you can set for prime units in precision i will set into zero the next for text i will change uh, text color into yellow and then symbol arrows i will set into architectural tick for lens we can set into red color and you can click ok we can click uh, set current again the next you can click close in here i will use for scales 150 you can click here and i will change into 150 use a dim line to create a dimension linear we can click from this point into here okay we create again from this point into here if you want to change uh, this text in uh, middle point of this line you can tap d and then click uh, modify in here you can click text and uh, use vertical in here we can change into center so it will be plus in the center of uh, this line you can click ok and close it will be automatically updates we create again dimension linear you can tap din line enter click from this uh, corner point into here the next from this point you can press shift button hold right click and we can just meet between two points click uh, from this point into here and then you can move into this point Okay, we create again from this point into corner point and the last from this point into this point. Okay, you can select uh, this dimension and you can click this uh, dot, dot points and move into here. Now we already create uh, this uh, simple floor plan with uh, AutoCAD software. And if you have any question about this tutorial, you can comment below this video.